Hi Cancer, it's Elle here to do your What's Up Wednesday reading. This will be a very quick reading for you. Uh, thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It is much appreciated. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's go ahead and jump into this. Thank you, Lord God, for blessing the Cancer Collective with a clear and concise message from you. All right, so we show up with the Hermit card and the Five of Wands. Um, the advice card is uh, you, yeah, you are loved. Is that focusing? It is not focusing. You are loved, okay? Um, it says you are here for a reason. Don't F it up, okay? So they want you to know you are loved. Some of you, okay, some of you are really on this, uh, this spiritual journey, this trip to enlightenment. Enlightenment firstly comes from knowing yourself, and that's what the hermit is doing. This is knowledge of self first. Knowledge of self, uh, of being self-aware, some of you are just being aware to you and your own personal philosophy that you've created for yourself in this life. Um, you might also be aware to the fact that maybe it's not working for you. It could be working against you uh, because you're looking at past experience with that hermit card and you're saying, you know, how can I be better? What do I know about me? What do I know about where I am thus far? Because it looks like you've turned your back with the Hermit card to the BS, to the Five of Wands. If you liked a lot of attention, a lot of chaos, a lot of drama, just um, a lot of stirring the pot, right now you may be spending a lot of time by yourself. In some situation, um, maybe of somebody leaving or something leaving or you leaving a situation has put you in that place where you need to start focusing on you and what it is you really want. Um, what it is you, you want to go after. Some of you are trying to go after a better and a healthier lifestyle. Not just what you eat or you put in your body, but healthy in terms of is this going to be productive to me getting to my end game, my end goal. What am I really doing? I'm keeping up a lot of confusion and I'm entertaining a lot of confusion, a lot of people, a lot of pettiness, a lot of drama. But where does it get me? What do I get out of it? Some of you may be coming to a place where it's getting old for you. Or you've dealt with somebody who kept up a lot of confusion within you, who stirred the pot with you, who the, the relationship was always about, you know, arguing and pettiness and it was fiery and it was, you know, all of those things. It was drama, it was romance, it was pettiness, it was childish behavior. Um, and some of you are just at a place where you just don't want to do that anymore. It's like you're, in a sense, maturing. But the maturing is coming from the fact that you're really identifying you and what you bring to every table, your personality, how you deal with other people. Um, knowledge of self here with a hermit card. And it says that maybe at first you were looking for answers outside of yourself. You were looking for validation outside of yourself but now you, you're really understanding that it really comes from within uh, the answers are within you you know what to do how to do it where to go sometimes when we don't want to listen to the inner voice we will start to project we will start to grasp for straws and pull on energy also it says that if you ghost it like a person uh, a relationship, some relationship that didn't have um, like a, a title where you were boyfriend and girlfriend or married or whatever. If you've ghosted situations like that or a person, um, this person is very chaotic in, in right now. And they're trying to, they're spinning their wheels in terms of trying to get you back. Because the Five of Wands talks about fighting for what you want. So there could be people or a person fighting for what they want with you your energy, your time, your affection, your love, whatever it may be. Um, it says don't leave these people hanging for too long because some of these people may feel as if they have um, a sense of entitlement to you or with you and it could turn ugly. So you're going to have to come out of hermit mode and deal with the fact that maybe you're over the chaos and you're really going to have to stand firm on that 
and stand firm in terms of being consistent, diligent, and to, uh, to live this healthy lifestyle, to start this new lifestyle, this new way of being. Uh, do know that you are loved because maybe all of this attention you got or you have, um, it, it didn't make you feel loved. It just made you feel admired or sought after. Um, somebody could have also wanted you as, you know, like a, you know, sex buddy or arm candy or it was very superficial. Okay, so Cancer, this is your reading. I hope that it resonates for you. If it does, go over to the website, book your own reading there. Take advantage of the text question where you can text the question to the number below. Pay for the question, receive the answer to your question on your mobile device. You can also donate to the channel by clicking the Buy Me A Coffee link. Thank you, Cancer. Many blessings to you.